Do you fancy learning some watercolour painting tips? Well, let me show you the quick tip on thinking about protecting the white of your paper when you're doing your painting. Let me show you what I mean. Now, when you're working on painting, one thing I always do, if you watch my videos, you'll see this, and that's to cover up the area where you're going to be putting your hand. Bear in mind I'm left-handed, so anywhere if I'm going to start painting on here, for example, trying to work on this American Robin, I'll make sure I don't want to get my hands on there, because you've obviously got natural oils on our hands. So just cover that area up with a piece of paper. That's all you've got to do. This is a double-folded, just folded twice, uh, piece of printing paper. That's all it is. And then you can very lightly apply the detail without getting natural oils or grease, whatever you want to call it, onto the watercolour paper. The other idea as well is to have a whole sheet of paper, cut out the robin, in this case the American robin in the middle, and then you've got all that section in between where you completely protect all the way around where you can work on the detail without any worry about getting your hands on the background. So that's a little tip on just covering up your artwork whilst you're working on it, okay? If you'd like to see more watercolour painting tips, head to patreon.com forward slash the Devon Artist and you'll see my full list of step-by-step -step video tutorials on how to paint wildlife in watercolour. Where you get also the project photo, the outline drawing for that month's project as well, and even a step-by-step -step handwritten or hand-typed by me full PDF on that particular current month's project. So come and join me and let's get painting together. And don't forget to click on like, subscribe and share. And please leave a comment down below as well. I'd love to kind of hear your thoughts and find out what you've been up to on your painting ventures. So until next time, bye-bye for now.